How's it going, guys? Lucia the Sword here, uh, watching some Brawlhalla for you, not playing today. Uh, we're going to check out um, some clips from the official Brawlhalla dev stream that was on Twitch a couple days ago. Some of you guys may have already seen this, but uh, I don't always have time to watch the uh, Twitch dev streams. So I thought I would make a video kind of recapping the Hellboy crossover skins because they show... All four of the Hellboy crossover skins, they show the, the signature moves and everything. So uh, without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into this. Uh, they do have some copyrighted music in the background, so I can't really play uh, the stream very loudly. Uh, well, we can bring it Hope you guys are having a fantastic day, by the way. <laughs> I had a really fun live stream today on PS4 with you guys. Let's, let's just, let's, let's, let's just, let's just so, dive yeah, right you in. Got, you got, there, I mean, I'm, number I'm one, there's Hellboy. Front, front so there he is. So Let's Hellboy go, is go. actually a cross skin, yeah, yeah. which, I mean, it makes sense, but there already is basically a, a, a Hellboy cross skin with the horns. I guess this is the official one. And then you got Gurak, Gurugach, which is a Taros. <laughs> crossover skin. <laughs> now, I don't know if they're calling these epic crossovers or not. Because, as you'll soon see, uh, not all of the skins have, like, signature effects or, like, different things like that. So, you can see right there, Taros Sigs look exactly the same. His, his axe and his hammer sigs, the effects are exactly the same. However, some of the other Hellboy skins are different. For example, uh, Hellboy. He's going to show off his sig right there. That was the side sig. You can see it looked uh, quite a bit different from the regular cross uh, signature effect. Which, you know, I don't know why they didn't give Taros uh, signature swaps. You would think that they would. Um, considering it's like an epic crossover skin, but I guess not. So that's Hellboy and Taros, we couldn't, we couldn't or Gurugach. Uh, it's pretty cool. Um, I thought there's a down oh, sig on Hellboy. Kind of just more of like a lava hand coming up. It's actually pretty cool how it travels along the uh, the side there. Sound effects are pretty much the same, though, on Hellboy. The the sound effects are actually a lot different on, um, on a couple of the other skins that you'll see. But yeah, his 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 blaster sigs look not quite as different. I mean, the 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 flames are a little different. They're like orange instead of red. Uh, but the the main uh, difference on the Hellboy cross skin is the gauntlet side sig and down sig for sure. Those look uh, a lot different. They also made a big deal out of the fact that uh, Hellboy actually does have asymmetrical hands. If you notice, okay, let's skip the ad here. Sorry about that. Sekiro is an awesome game, though. You can see Hellboy, when he looks left or right, he actually has his big hand like he normally does in the movie. So it's pretty cool. They Apparently, that was tech, uh, technical difficulty to do. I don't know why, but uh, apparently it was. Took a team of programmers to get that to, to happen. <laughs> so pretty cool. I, I think Hellboy looks really good. I think, uh, you know... There's so many, like, dates yeah. that we have it's kind of hit or miss. I, I'm not really like a huge yeah. Hellboy fan. I'm not that big into yeah, like Hellboy, but $5 it's pretty cool. It's it's always good to see yeah. other like uh, $5 franchises $5 coming into Brawlhalla because it's yeah, just yeah. Uh, it's, it's good publicity so basically. So you can also see the background and everything looks looks different too. I'm assuming that's going to be for like the Hellboy event, which is coming in April. So uh, right. now they're gonna show off the new Dusk I'm, I'm skin, Nimue. Oh, we're gonna, we're really. Yeah, we're Which gonna Nimue gonna has a, a lock in animation. So, let's see yeah, if they show Nimue. All right, so next one. All right, here's, here's Nimue, which is a Dusk skin. But after this, you know who I'm playing. Nimue. So, pretty cool, Nimue. Uh, I don't know, man. She, she looks kind of like. Kind of almost like a dude. And also, this map looks awesome. Uh, this is a new map that they didn't actually plan on showing off, but they did on accident. It's pretty awesome. I love seeing uh, better looking maps in Brahalla for sure. They, they need more of these. It's nice to see. It's nice to see. Even if we only get one every few months, it's still nice to see. So Nimue has way different sounds. And they sound different too. You can... 
hear what they sound like. Yeah, I'm best. Man, yeah me too. <laughs> I don't know why they give uh, Nimue and Hellboy uh, different signature effects and not Taros. I feel bad for Taros mains. So yes, we finally got an epic crossover skin for Taros. Oh, but it's just a skin. There's no signature effects, no uh, anything else. Just a skin. The Nimue looks awesome, though. I mean, she she sounds awesome. The graphics on the on the Sigs look awesome too. How many shots does he have left? But like. How she looks herself, she almost looks kind of basic and plain. I, I, again, I don't really follow Hellboy. I don't know if that's how she's supposed to look. Obviously, it probably is, but she doesn't look particularly awesome to me. But her signature moves do look awesome. Oh, that was a really nice grab by Foda. So, I don't know. She's kind of hit or miss. Her orb sigs are cool as well. Her her spear sigs are cool. So, so today, uh, today we are also testing. Hellboy does come out uh, April twelfth, I believe. So I'm assuming that's when the uh, patch will go live, but we'll see. Oh, I suck. Yeah. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right, yeah, this is the skin that you guys are probably waiting for the most. This is the new Mordex epic crossover skin. Daimyo. 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 Also known as uh, Cheeto Puffs, man. Or che <laughs> che <laughs> he looks like Cheddar the che Cheetah, <laughs> or whatever his name is. <laughs> looks awesome, though. This is honestly, out of all the Hellboy skins, this one looks the best, in my opinion. Hellboy and this one. Nimue. Or no, what is his name? I don't even remember his name. I already forgot. Oh, Daimyo. Daimyo. <laughs> All right, well, you want to know what? You're making him look oh, bad. Yeah. Uh, okay. So Daimo has uh, spear and gauntlets, yeah, and they look sigs. really cool. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. Like... Oh, listen, different sig effects, good. different sig sounds. sounds. I think the Mordex skin is amazing out of all of them. It's my favorite. Look at the effects. We made Mordex a cat. It almost, ma yeah, they made him a cat. <laughs> Instead of a wolf. Should have been an Azuri skin. Should have been an Azuri skin, but oh well. Still looks awesome. Sigs are looking clean. Let's see a scythe sigs. There's one right there. Let's see the side sig. active input, the 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 down sig with the forward active input. That was one of the ones that was giving us, I guess you could say, hell with the Hellboy vest. Let's see the let's see the side sigs. Oh come on, stop killing it. Worried about like, do we need to say hell or something? But he double hockey stick, man. Nah, dude, hell oh, that looks sick. The side sig actually did look sick. He did it there for a second. I don't know if you guys caught that. Let's look at all the colors now. They're going to show off the colors here. So you got... I'm staying on. Oh! I'm moving on. cat and pig. Cat and pig colors here. So... Yellow. Which one came first? Yeah. That's cool. Herps? I don't know what to think, guys. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? Which is the best one? Daimyo? Guragach? Naimu, Naimu, I forget. I'm already forgetting their names. Or uh, Hellboy himself. A little bit, we'll get our Peppa Pig crossover in there. I really like uh, Daimyo, the the skin. Should have been an Azuri skin, but whatever. It looks it looks good on Mordex too. It's just you know a cat and a wolf. We already have a cat in Brahalla. Why put him on? Why put Daimyo on a wolf skin? But it's all good. Yeah, the home team colors look really good. Haunting colors look really good. Actually, uh, Gurugash looks really cool, that color. And then they're going to go ahead and show off Naimu, Naimu, however you say your name. Oh, she actually looks good on the uh, Cyan. I liked her Cyan colors. And let's see, Hellboy. Hellboy looks good in all the colors. Uh, he, he has, like, high contrast, like, colors almost. I like him a lot. Home team colors always looks good. I don't know. They're like my favorite. Hellboy looks almost the same red as he does default. You guys notice that? Like he almost looks exactly the same red or default. White Hellboy looks cool. So does black. Heatwave Hellboy is actually really cool. I like that a lot. Definitely. No Alright guys, well that's about it. I just wanted to show you the skins from the stream. Uh, 
You guys can actually just go look at this on Twitch yourself if you wanted. But, oh, actually, Goldforge looked pretty cool on uh, on, on Hellboy. I, I just want to call him Cross, but... So, yeah, pretty hype, pretty hype. New maps, new art, new crossover skins. There's a lot of stuff coming to Brawlhalla in April. Supposedly, Crossplay also coming in April. That's major, obviously. And then, who knows what other skins they may come out with in April. You know, they may come out with a whole new legend. You know, usually you get at least one new legend every month, you know, typically. So, I would like to see uh, if they come out with a new weapon. Or, I'm sorry, not a new weapon. They probably for sure won't come out with a new weapon. But a new legend this month would be nice. In addition to all this content and uh, the crossplay patch, April would be a hell of a month for Brawlhalla. No pun intended. <laughs> Alright guys, actually a little bit. A little bit pun intended. <laughs> Whoa, not another advertisement. All right, this is Lucian Sword. Drop the video a like if you enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe for more Brawlhalla content. As always, guys, this is Lucian Sword. Take it easy. Hope to see you in the next video, guys.